Just like many other war games, Player Unknown's Battlegrounds uses a variety of interesting weapons that actually exist in real life and have a very fascinating history behind them. Of course, these weapons appeared in tons of other games long before PUBG was even invented. But for the sake of the huge popularity that PUBG currently enjoys, we're gonna look at these guns from this game's perspective. So without any further ado, here's a brief history of PUBG weapons. Number 1. The Tommy Gun Also known as the Annihilator is an American submachine gun invented by General John Thompson in 1917. At the time, the US had yet to join the First World War, but Thompson knew that the US military was in desperate need of updated weapons to compete with the European powers. For that, he began working on a gun that would be capable of rapid fire without manual reloading and at the same time being light and portable. Unfortunately for General Thompson, the war had already ended by the time the first shipment of the submachine guns was ready. However, only two decades later, the Tommy gun was adopted by the US military serving during the Second World War and beyond. Number 2. The SLR The SLR is a British sniper rifle that was produced between the late 50s and the mid 80s and was used mostly by British Commonwealth countries including the UK, Australia and Canada. This rifle was introduced in the PC 1.0 update number 12 and can be seen as a more powerful version of the SKS, dealing more damage at the expense of more recoil. Number 3. The Vector This submachine gun was designed and developed by the American company Chris USA since 2006. Thanks to its low recoil and high rate of fire, this gun is an excellent option for close to mid-range combat. However, the major downside to this weapon is its low hit damage as well as its very small magazine capacity of just 13 rounds. Therefore, attaching an extended magazine is a must for anyone wishing to use this gun further into the match. Number 4. The h and K Guns There are two guns in PUBG that are designed and produced by the German company Heckler & Koch, the M416 and the UMP. The M416 assault rifle is based on the H&K416 whose production began in 2004 and has numerous variations today. Additionally, due to its widespread popularity and its adoption as the standard rifle by many armed forces around the world, it has become a very common weapon used in movies and video games. In Battlegrounds, the M416 is unquestionably a fan favorite due to the number of attachments it can accept allowing a great amount of flexibility. As to the UMP, it is hands down the best SMG weapon out there and can come really handy especially in crowded areas like Pachinki at the beginning of the round. Number 5. The Carabiner 98K It can be said that this is the second most highly sought weapon for snipers because of its ability to deal fatal damage against players wearing level 2 helmets or below. The Car 98K was introduced by German arms manufacturer Mauser in 1935 and was quickly adopted by the German Wehrmacht in World War II. Because of its reliability, great accuracy and effectiveness, many allied forces including the Soviet Union and France used the car in the years following the end of the war. Number 6. The VSS This suppressed sniper rifle was issued specifically to the Russian special forces for undercover operations back in the 80s. Additionally, this weapon isn't really popular in the game because it deals very low damage compared to other sniper rifles. Nonetheless, the VSS is actually very common in real life and is used as the main rifle by many special forces around the globe. Number 7. The Fabrique Nationale Weapons there are three weapons in PUBG that are produced by the Belgian firearms manufacturer Fabrique Nationale Herstel. These include the M16, the M249, and the notorious Scar L. As for the M16, it is one of the most recognizable rifles around the world and was used as a standard weapon of the US military in the Vietnam War. Similarly, Scar L is pretty much an updated version of the M16 with more stability and a reduced muzzle noise. Concerning the M249 machine gun, it can only be found in airdrops and is an excellent weapon to lay down suppressing fire 
since it has a high rate of fire combined with relatively good accuracy. Number 8. The AKM There is literally nothing that is unknown about this assault rifle, thanks to its popularity and availability inside the game and out. The AKM is simply a modernized version of the notorious AK-47 and was introduced into service with the Soviet Army in 1959. In-game, this powerful weapon deals more damage than pretty much any other assault rifle. However, the downside to this gun is its high recoil, which makes it a not-so-suitable option for long-range combat. Last but not least, we have the AWM. This is by far the most badass gun in the game, and it's every sniper's dream to get their hands on one of this. As a result, it can only be found in airdrops just like other highly sought firearms. The AWM has been in service since 1996 and is manufactured by British company Accuracy International. As a long-range rifle, the AWM was used by British Army sniper Craig Harris to score the second longest confirmed sniper kill by eliminating two Taliban machine gunners in Afghanistan at a range of almost 2,500 meters. In-game, it is the only gun capable of killing players in one shot to the head at distances beyond 500 meters. Did I leave out your favorite weapon? Let me know in the comment section below. For more, make sure to like the video and subscribe to Game Loop.